Mr. Smith, when Clyde got the splinter from the totem pole, could that have activated its energy? Hey, stop saying that! It is conceivable. None of this makes sense, Sky. You turning your back on Clyde doesn't make sense. Even his mum's throwing him out. She feels just the same way you and Ronnie feel. Like something's been torn out of her life and she can't remember what it is. <laughs> well, it isn't him. I hate him. Why, Ronnie? Think about it. You both love Clyde. You'd never turn your backs on him. The only way this could happen is some alien messing with your heads. Clyde needs us. Stop saying that name, please. Sarah Jane, your reaction to his name suggests that Sky is correct. You have been subjected to a psychophonic programming, possibly designed to keep Clyde isolated. Well, say that's true. Why? Because Hatakun needs Clyde. What if he's found a way to escape? The longer Clyde's out there, the more powerful he's getting. The legend said that if the totem pole fell back into the hands of men, then Hetakum Tech would escape. Hands of men? Clyde got a splinter. It's a curse and you've got to break it. Her name, just the sound of it, it's agony. It hurts. His name's the key. His mum couldn't say it. Maybe if you can, it'll break the curse. Good. You've got to. We've got to find Clyde. It's the only way of stopping her to contact escaping. We can do this, Ronnie. Yeah, well, it's just a name. We can say it, right? Okay. Say it. Say it. Come on. Clyde Langer. Clyde Langer. You know, I was thinking I could do this, like a street artist. We could go up to Covent Garden or somewhere and people will pay to have their portraits drawn. On the back of old paper bags? <laughs> well, no, I'll get a drawing pad. I've already got the pencils. I'm telling you, Ellie, we can do this. We can get off the streets together. Stay here. I'm gonna go get us a coffee to share. I feel like celebrating. Okay. Clyde! So is Jane. Ronnie? Oh, 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 what have I done? Oh, we've been looking for you all night. You have to thank Sky. The curse didn't affect her. She fought so hard for you. Thank you, Sparky. Something alien is trapped in the totem pole, and somehow it's using you to get free. And if it does, we are in trouble. But well, we need you back at the attic. But I've got to wait for someone, my friend. Clyde, there isn't time, we have to go. But I can't leave her, you don't understand. We have to go, Clyde, we have to go, please. Ellie? Oh. Ellie! Clyde, listen to me. That thing break free at any moment. I'm coming back. 